Cheers, cheers. I just do my bottle. Bro, that's what's up. Hey there, that's what's up. Let's go. Nah, I was Oh, there. please. Oh. <laughs> please. Oh. <laughs> please. Oh. <laughs> oh. Should I bring up a picture? Yeah, that picture will go. Hey. Hey. Oh, hey, that was a good one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, <laughs> that's what I keep saying. Let's get it, let's get it. Shall I just stand here? Why wait? You want some? <laughs> Are you sure? Are you sure? Why would I be saying I messaged you? But I know that. That's what I'm saying. I've been trying to tell. That's what I've been saying. I've been trying to tell. Are you ready to go? Yeah. Um, no, I thought I'm not going to tell you. I'm stopping by before you don't know. Yeah, we can. Cool. 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 Wait, wait, hey, yo, yo, yo. My mom's not home. Hey, 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 hey. Let's turn up more. Let's go, let's go to your house. Yeah, let's get it. Right, let's, let's get, get it. it. Let's, let's go. go. Let's go. Don't forget the bottle. Oh. Kendall, how long your college apps go? Yeah. I have. I think I have like three. Who's driving you two? Because I can drive them, but I can't drive you guys. Me? What's what's wrong with me driving? What's wrong with you driving? You've been drinking from that bottle the whole time. <sighs> Bro, I'm good. I can do it. Nah, you got too much to drink. Hey, uh, let me drive. Give me the keys. All right, all right. Whatever you say. Here you go. Don't worry. Stop I got it. <laughs> okay. Better drive safely, bro. I will. Well, yeah, I even had that much to drink. Man, he had like two <laughs> beers. How many yeah, beers did he have? Like two, yeah, right? Like two, yeah. yeah. So you know where my address is, right? Yeah. All right, this y'all, Brandon. Bye, guys. Bye. 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 Drive? Yeah, bro, I told you, you don't gotta worry about that. I'm cool. I'm a lot better than you are. I swear. I swear. You drank way more than me, you know it. I mean, but like, alcohol is alcohol. Yeah, but you drink a lot more alcohol is alcohol than I do. That's true, that's true. How many tests this week? Yeah, I do. I have an English test on Friday. Yeah, I have an English test on Friday. Yo, who is that girl right there? I don't know if she is fine though. Yo, yo, yo! <laughs> Now I'm an emergency. What are you reporting? Hi, there's been a car crash. Okay, where's it at? A, a Rio Americano High School. Okay, Rio Americano High School. Okay, where is that at? On American River Drive. American River Drive, and what's across the street? Uh, Savern. And what kind of vehicle? Uh, it's a silver and a dark car. Are they blocking the roadway? Yes. Okay, is there anybody injured? Yeah, there's a lot of blood. It's Brandon. He's like on the top of the car on the hood, and there's Zach, but I don't know if he's moving. Okay, Brandon's on top of the hood, bleeding, and he's not moving. Mm -mm. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and get the fire department started. I want okay. you to be very careful. What's your name? Asha Armstrong. Okay, I w again, I want you to be very careful. We're going to get everybody on the way, okay? Okay, thank you. You're welcome. Bye. 
Carrying 7, BC 7, engine 106, check 106, medic 106, vehicle accident with extrication, Rio Americano High School, 4540, American Overdrive. Vehicle accident with extrication, multiple patients, Rio Americano High School, 4540, American Overdrive. Fire map 152 off the floor, operation C tanker 2. Seven, seven, one, ten, one, Medic one, zero, five. Response for two car motor vehicle accident. Response for American Overdrive. Rio Americano High School. You're gonna tell me direct Help! Somebody help! Beast. 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 I didn't know it was going to happen. B. B. Wake up, please. Please wake up, B. Please, right here, right here, please. Right here, right, 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 right there, on the trip, all right? We're going to take care of this. Battalion 7 confirmed, we have four patients. B! Oh, we're coming for extrication. I've got a helicopter around also. Copy that. Please, please hold my brakes, please. Before you. I'm driving, I'm driving this car. Just come on, all right. Ready! B! I'll talk to you in a sec. Are you ready? No. Are you sure? Yeah. I'm not sure. Can you hit your head? I think so. Like, hit your cheek. Driver uh, who appears to be uninjured, but uh, I believe intoxicated. 110 copy. Speed buys confirmed 1055. Confirmed 1055. Got the uh, corner and route. I've got three patients, one's a DOA. Um, I got the driver uh, over there. He appears to be non injured, uh, but I'm smelling uh, some possible alcohol. Right up. Okay. Hey, man, what's your name? Zach Lewin. What? Zach Lewin. Zach, where are you driving the car? Where are you guys coming from? Sure, stand up. Right, I'm coming from the river. And we're going back to his house just to hang out. Okay. okay. Randy! Come on. B! B! Come on, this way, buddy. Flight Guard, Reach 17, Flight Jack. Reach 17, Flight Guard, Zach Fire is requesting you to Rio Americano High School for a head-on motor vehicle crash. Flight Guard, Reach 17, you could show us accepting with a 680 TLO.
run you through some field sobriety tests, okay? Just to see what your sobriety level is, all right? I'm not here to try to trick you, so if you don't understand, you just let me know and I'll explain to you again, all right? I'm gonna move it side to side, don't move your head, okay? You understand? Just follow your eyes. You understand? Yes, sir. Hands down by your side. Okay. Kind of loud. One. One. Blow, 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 blow. Good. Right now you're at a point one one. Okay. So you had more than two drinks. Right? Because you're gonna be placed under arrest. Okay, so go ahead and turn around. Interlace your hands behind your back. I mean your head, sorry. Separate your feet. Go move that hand. All right. All right, so what you're being arrested for is a felony DUI. Vehicular manslaughter. Your buddy's dead. Okay? All right? Here we go. Coming in code three with the ETA of about five minutes on board to have a 17 year old female that's one seven year old female. She had positive neck and back pain. She has negative sensation below the waist. She has a fracture to her left forearm. Uh, note that there is major front end damage to both vehicles. There was a death in the other vehicle. The patient is full C spine. She has an IV established. Unless you have anything further, we'll see you in about four minutes.
Watch your head. All right, so you're going to do a, a blood or a breath test. You're required by California state law to take a blood or a breath test. What do you want to take? I'll take a breath test. Breath test? All right. How do you spell your last name? Lewin, L-E-W-I. Take a deep breath and blow. Blow, 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 Good. All right. You know what the legal limit in California is? For someone over 21. 0.08. With somebody under 21. Zero. Zero. Okay. You're at a 0.10 right now. Right. So that's about one and a half over. All right. Come on up. I'm gonna walk over here. Keep your hands behind your back for me. We're gonna walk this way. Well, can you grab a machine? I'll let you know uh, what I know right now. Uh, so, she was in a massive car accident. She had, was in a head on collision and she had significant damage to her face and head. Um, she has a depressed skull fracture. With exposed brain matter, and she right now she's not really moving at all. When she first came in, she was responding a little bit to painful stimuli, but over the course of time, her pupils became uneven, and which basically says, stated that her um, her brain is failing. Okay. As of this point, um, she is brain dead. Right now, we have her on a vent, which is a breathing tube, and it's breathing for her. And we are giving her medications to actually get her heart rate up because her heart is failing because the brain is not telling her what to do. The good thing is, it was so sudden that it was probably relatively painless for her. But the bad thing is, um, dangers are catastrophic. So I still have her on life support right now. You guys might want to talk about this and see her. Something else, unfortunate to um, consider in this difficult situation is if you want to. Donate her organs. What happened to everybody else? Did anyone else? Is anyone else in the car? Else? Unfortunately, I'm not allowed to talk about anyone else in the car. Unfortunately, I'm only allowed to talk about specific patients with the privacy laws. Was somebody with her when she died? Once again, I cannot really comment on this. Me thinks the most. I didn't want her to be alone. <laughs> yeah. It's your daddy. You've been there, John. Okay? I love you so much. Please, you get in there. We love you so much. You're gonna do great things in life. Okay? You're gonna do great things. Come on, hang in there. This is happening, Carolyn. We're supposed to do great things in life. Carolyn, I love you. Love you, Carolyn. In the yellow box, face this way. Got any oxygen or poker stick me? No needle weapons, nothing like that on them. No shoot. Left sock, take it off in the back. Don't shake it out. Put your pinkies in your cheeks. Put your cheeks up and down so I can see your gums. Up. Open your mouth underneath your tongue. Tongue. Put your shoes on. Socks can go in your pocket for right now. Put your socks in your pocket. Stay inside the yellow one. Move the box. Back towards the wall. Go to the camera. Alright, go ahead and turn to your right. Turn your right with the X down at the far wall. Keep looking at that X over my shoulder and see your thumb. Hi, I'm Dr. Wu. I'm Dr. Hi. Taking Care of Kendall. Um, I'll let you know what's going on so far. So, she was in a head on collision. It was a pretty bad one. There was a, a lot of damage to the car. As well as the fact that uh, she's also pretty beat up herself. She most likely has wrist fracture. Most likely has, uh, I guess, a part where her face is broken. Um, but the biggest kicker is she can't feel or move her legs at this point. 
there's a possibility that she might never walk again. Um, but the biggest thing is right now, she is freaked out. And I know how scary it is for you guys right now, but right now when you guys go in the room, I need you guys to be strong. So she's conscious? She's conscious. Okay. And um, right now, basically, she most likely had a spinal cord um, injury. The question is exactly where. We're waiting for our radios to give us a call to tell you exactly where. Um, but then our neurosurgery team is going to come down and take a look at her as well. And based on what we have so far, um, she currently is paralyzed. I think how this could be lifelong, this is some She's slower paralyzed. gains. Yes, she can't move her legs at all. Uh, she can move her arms, thankfully. So, uh, however, she can't move her legs at all. She can't feel her legs at all whatsoever. Zach, Lula. Hello? Mom. Mom, b before I say anything, I want you to know I'm okay, I'm healthy, everything's okay. Uh, but I'm in jail right now, I got in a car accident. I was driving Brandon's car, I was drinking. He was drinking, but I thought I had a, didn't have that much. So I, I told him that I could drive and I, and I crashed it. And, and, and I, I'm sorry, Mom. I'm in jail right now, I'm in a cell. I was hanging out with Brandon. Yes, please, and please, before you do anything, please make sure he's okay. I don't, I don't know, he wasn't conscious when I left. Please make sure Brandon's okay. There was a lot of blood and he was unresponsive. I don't know, I don't know if he's okay, and I didn't know he's okay. Step in for a moment, please. Yes, please, come in. Is Brandon Collins your son? Yes. Okay. Um, Ma'am, I regret to tell you that your son was killed in a collision today on uh, American River Drive in front of the high school. No. Um, yeah, he was a passenger. He wasn't wearing his seatbelt, and the driver uh, was driving under the influence. No. And um, I'm, I'm so sorry. No. And the uh, the coroners are going to need you to uh, be able to identify the body. Uh, yeah, I am so sorry for your loss.
our top story tonight, an update on a tragic event we brought you back in November. 18 year old Zachary Lewin was in court this morning for his sentencing in the tragic deaths and injury of three Rio Americano High School students. In November of this year, Zachary, one day shy of his 18th birthday and while under the influence of alcohol, made the decision to get behind the wheel of his car and drive. With his friend in the passenger seat, Zachary lost control of his vehicle and drove into oncoming traffic, hitting a Volkswagen Jetta head on. Zachary's friend and passenger, Brandon Collins, who was not wearing his seat belt, was killed instantly in the crash. The driver of the other vehicle, 17 year old Kendall Soriano, also a Rio Americano High School student, suffered major injuries and was paralyzed in the crash. Her passenger, Carolyn Lidster, died later at the hospital from her injuries. Cal Carolyn, only 16 years old. Although technically still 17 at the time of the accident, Zachary was charged as an adult in the Sacramento Superior Court today. And he was found guilty of DUI with great bodily injury, as well as two counts of manslaughter. He was sentenced this morning to 21 years in state prison. Tonight, we remember the victims in that tragic and very preventable crash. I'm Walt Gray, ABC 10 News.